one. So today I'm going to show you the things I got from my baby shower. I'm doing a baby shower haul today and I'm so excited because I'm about to do all the laundry and sterilize and get everything ready and organized which is just blowing my mind getting ready to add another member of the spooky family uh and here we are it's happening everybody <laughs> i hope you're ready because i'm not <laughs> but i'm gonna show you some of the things i got from my baby shower and this is from my shower only so i'm gonna do a separate spooky family shower that's gonna be in a totally separate video so everything i'm showing today is from the shower my mom my stepmom and our family friend who's basically like my second mom they all threw a shower for me here you might grab a snack or a beverage I have two beverages actually. <laughs> I have a flavored beverage and a water. Just good old water. I, I'm, I came prepared because I feel like we're going to be here for a while. So I'm going I'm to try to get through it as quickly as possible. But you know me. I love to jab my jaws. Also, everything I mentioned in this video, I'll try to link down in the description box or the, um, there's a little box below the description box that says products and current video. If you click on that, if you're on your phone, it'll drop down. And if you're on your computer, I believe it's still on the right side of the screen. I think they're trying to change that to drop down too, but I don't think they've done it yet. I don't know. I'm getting used to all the technologies and things, but um, I like the products and current video box because it shows pictures of the item so you can actually see what you're looking at. So I like that better than just the list of endlessness in the description. Anyways, where do we start? I'm so excited to show you all these baby things. Uh, I love all the little baby products. By the way, I guess I should put a little warning out there that this is such a first time mom uh, baby shower haul. I know everyone's different. Every baby is different and the only way to find out is to try the products for yourself and see if they work for you. So I registered for the things that I thought that I would use, but I don't know. They have so many different baby products out there. You can't help but get sucked in. So anyways, longest story longer. I'm a first time mom, so go easy on me. Anyways, the first thing I got, let's start here, was this, this is definitely much needed in my opinion. This, uh, infant bathtub situation. It's like a bath seat thing. Bath support. That's what it's called. That's what they're calling it. Um, and it's zero to six months and it's this kind of bath support thing that you put in your bathtub or your sink or wherever you're bathing your baby. And the reason I picked this one was because a lot of them had a lot of cloth and mesh and things that I felt like would be more difficult to clean or could easily get moldy, mildewy, that kind of thing. Where this, this one has more of a silicone feeling area in the middle, like it's plastic on the outside, but silicone where the baby lays. I've seen people, if they think that this is a little hard for their baby to lay in, they'll put a burp cloth down or some sort of towel or washcloth down just to make it a little softer. But I just like that it's so easy to clean and it's not gonna start stinking or getting weird and moldy. I'm really excited about this and I just got the gray one. It comes in different colors, I got the gray. Uh, what else did we get everybody? Okay, I'm gonna mention this because it's kind of big and it's right here. I took it out of the box already. Got this diaper pail. This is the Munchkin diaper pail. Uh, Munchkin is the brand. It has a whole, whoa, it's flying open. Up here at the top, um, you have like a deodorizer thing that attaches to it. That's what I really liked about this one was the deodorizer that attaches to the top where it can neutralize any poopy smells, you know? So I really liked this one because, well, first of all, I really liked the aesthetic. And then I liked kind of how I mentioned, I liked the little area you can put a little deodorizer kind of thing, attach it there. And then I also got, let's see, what what's next? Got a couple of breastfeeding situations. I got these reusable, washable nursing pads, which, I don't know, let's open them up and take a look. Let's take a gander. Um, they're just some reusable nursing pads. I don't have any scissors in here to open these up, but it came with these cute little bags, like a little washing bag and then a storage bag, which is really nice. And I also got this Hakka breast pump, which is supposed to be like, I don't know. I, I don't know anything about anything, everybody. <laughs> I'm just winging it, everybody. Just winging it. Um, but it's this silicone manual breast pump that you're, I don't, I don't know. Some people put it on, like, as you're breastfeeding on one side, you attach this to the other side and it catches milk. And then you can save it for later. So, I don't know. I like that idea of not wasting milk. 
if you're leaking on the other side as you're breastfeeding. All right, next up, let's talk about something really exciting. I'm so excited for this. This is the most obnoxious, colorful situation I've ever seen in my life. Coming from somebody who very rarely branches out into any sort of colorful anything. So this will be a whole new experience for me. But, I, you know, the baby is going to like color because it's a baby. You know what I mean? This is the most obnoxious baby toy ever. But apparently, it's all the rage in the baby realm. It is this kick and play, is that what it's called? Yeah, kick and play piano gym. So it has a little piano that they can kick when they're a baby and then when they get a little older they can hit it or whatever they want to do with it, play it. <laughs> I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> Who knows? That's to be determined. A lot of people have said, yeah, this isn't the most aesthetic toy, but babies love it and it's something they can use when they're really young. And from what I've seen, that's kind of the weird thing. There aren't a lot of, well, I mean, obviously, because they're an infant and they're not doing much, but there are very few little, little baby toys, like for the infants. Uh, so this one apparently is a good one. I also got this one. This is the Love Every Play Mat. It's like a whole tummy time, play mat, mental stimulation, whole situation is what it is. From what I understand, it's designed in a way to help with brain development and learning and all that kind of stuff, which I was really excited about. So I have one that has the most stimulation and the sounds and music and all the things. This is more of the tummy time meets mental stimulation. They use this really early on kind of thing. Um, so I also got this one, but I also thought maybe we keep one downstairs, one in his bedroom, or I don't know what we're doing yet, but here we are. Um, anyways, I bought into it, I'm sold. Next. <laughs> All right, so next up, cannot wait to get this set up. I got the Skip Hop, that's the brand, wipe clean changing pad but it's a changing pad you can wipe clean so instead of the changing pads that have all the different covers and then you have to wash the cover and put a new cover on all that kind of stuff that just sounds high maintenance to me so i'm all excited about this changing pad that you can just easily wipe clean so i love that whole idea and i also love that it's gray and anyways i'm just so excited to set up this whole changing station. Next up, another essential. I don't really know how to show this because it's still in the box. Just a mattress in a box right now. Uh, we're getting ready to set this up. I cannot wait. I'm just so excited to do all this. Um, uh, but this is the crib and toddler mattress in a box. And so um, it's a breathable firm foam mattress is what it is. But my grandma got this mattress for us. So grandma, if you're watching, thank you again. We love our mattress. I can't wait to get it all set up. But next up, this is one of those, this is one of those polarizing items where people either feel like it's essential or you don't need it kind of situation. But for me, I'm gonna be using breast pumps. So I felt like this for me was an essential. That's again, to be determined. But I got this Baby Brezza One Step Sterilizer Dryer. So it's a sterilizer slash dryer you can use it for bottles pacifiers uh, breast pump parts all that kind of stuff and it sterilizes it and I know some people are like you just throw it in boiling water and call it a day but all the breast pump parts and I have two breast pumps and all the things I just thought this would be really easy and convenient and you can sterilize and dry quickly and that's what I was thinking should we get it out and see I should have brought some scissors but this is like the sticker of doom. Not another sticker, don't do this to me. Here we go, here we go. Oh, of course, it's packaged in the most obnoxious plastic packaging that's gonna reflect right off of all my lighting. Uh, but it looks like a spaceship is what it looks like. All right, next up I got this Moby wrap, which is a, it's a whole wrap, like a baby wrap, um, where you know you can wear your baby or attach your baby to your body via the, <laughs> the Moby wrap. Uh, and of course I got it in black because what other color would I get it in? Maybe if the baby hates it, I can at least wear means in it. <laughs> Next I got, this is so cute, this Fisher Price uh, sit me up floor seat with tray. It's this cute little seat with a little monkey. If you can see the little gray monkey on it, this is so cute. This is one of those products that so many moms told me about and they're like, you have to get one of these. Like if they're still too little for their high chair or 
whatever it is. You can sit your baby in it. You can give them a little snack, put your baby in there while you're doing the dishes or while you're making yourself food or whatever. But here's a better visual. Here it is all big on the back with the little monkey. It's so cute. Um, I got a couple of bottle sets. I wanted to try a couple different bottles. I got some samples of the Dr. Brown's bottles. And so I wanted to try a couple others just in case. So I registered for a couple different ones. I registered for this ma'am, ma'am, mom, whatever brand it is. I don't know, but apparently this is a good one for babies who are breastfed. And it comes with two five ounce bottles and two nine ounce bottles. And then a couple of pacifiers too in here. They're supposed to be anti-colic and all the things, I don't know. We're gonna try a couple different bottles out. And then I also got this one, the Philips Avid Natural. Heard a lot of good things about these bottles. It's a whole little set. Let me open this. The stickers they put on this, these clear stickers of doom. Okay, and this one comes with five bottles, three four ounce bottles, two nine ounce bottles, a couple of pacifiers and a cleaning brush. I like the aesthetic of these. They're just kind of a basic clear, can't see much because of the glare, but they're kind of just a basic clear bottle, but the nipple's really cool on these. Can I say that on YouTube, nipple? <laughs> I don't know. So that's the Philips Avent, Avent, whatever you call it. All right, next up, moving on to some cute little baby things. I have a whole bag of some baby things. Um, I got this, my mom's friend got me this and I didn't register for this, but I definitely needed this. Didn't even think about it, but such a good idea. This baby briefcase and it has all the baby's things that you're gonna need. Like their birth certificate, social security card, insurance, all their vaccinations, everything all in one place. I didn't even think of this and I am totally gonna need it. I was really glad that at least somebody thought of it. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna put this in my hospital bag because I guess they give you a bunch of paperwork and just take it with me to the doctor's appointments. Really glad I got this. Also, I got this set of sheets. These crib sheets, oh my gosh, they're black and white. They're so cute, might as well open them. And they're so soft. And they come in all these cute little prints. Cloud print, which is so cute black and white stripes for a whole beetle baby situation, uh, black and white polka dots, and these little black and white elephants. And also got, okay, look how cute this is. Baby banana toothbrush, everybody. Oh my gosh. Let's open this up, because you gotta see this. Look how tiny this little toothbrush is. It's just one of those baby products that makes me melt. It's so cute. Anyways, next up, I got these. And my mom's friend, another thing she thought of that I didn't think of, these peepee teepees. Have you seen these? So apparently when you're changing baby boy's diaper, you put this over his little peepee, -pee, and that way if he starts having a little fountain situation, um, <laughs> Here we are, we have arrived, y'all. We are now officially talking about PPTPs, all right? Anyways, got those. Um, I also got this Mommy's Bliss. It's like a whole newborn essential set. So it has gripe water, vitamin D drops, gas relief drops, and saline drops slash spray. Also got this, this is so cute. This Boone Cacti brush set. It's a whole brush set that looks like cacti but it's a whole brush set for cleaning bottle parts, breast pump parts, all that kind of stuff. It, but it comes in this, it looks like a pot. But you have these little cleaning parts, these little brush parts, and they look like little cacti. And you can put it next to your sink, and it looks like a little cacti situation. But it's actually bottle cleaning parts. Also got these cute little bath toys. Like a little shark, and a little baby turtle, a little puffer fish, all these cute little ocean creatures all in one little bath set. I also got this toy. I feel like this is one of those toys that I see any kid I babysat or moms that I know have this toy. Uh, this little Baby Einstein take along tunes. The baby can hold on to it and it plays little songs. Also got this nail file. Okay, I've been hearing about this nail file situation that instead of clipping your baby's nails and being terrified of over clipping, you know what I mean? They have these little baby nail files and it comes in this cute little case. 
And on the inside it has these little files and you can just file your baby's nails down instead of clipping them. But yeah, got this baby nail file. And then my sister-in-law, my brother got me this, this hatch sound machine and light situation and it changes colors. So I plan on using this in my bedroom at first when I'm breastfeeding at night um, to where I don't have to wake everybody up by turning on all these harsh lights. I'm just gonna use this little night light. And um, I've heard it's amazing. It's also an amazing sound machine. So I got it for that reason. This has a bunch of amazing reviews. Anyways, so what else we got? <laughs> Deep breaths, everybody. Oh my gosh, funny story behind this one. My sister-in-law and brother got me this as well. This toy, this box. Because when I would babysit their girls, they had a toy similar to this, except theirs was pink and purple. Uh, so when I told my brother he was gonna be an uncle, he turned to my sister-in-law and was like, we gotta get her the box. <laughs> because I played with this non-stop when I would watch my niece or come over and play with her. Uh, I love this box thing. And I know all the different songs already. Longest story longer. It has different activities on each side. Uh, now I'm excited to have it for my little son. And all right, next up I got some different uh, soaps, body lotions, all sorts of stuff like that. I wanted to try several different brands. I was really interested in trying this Hello Bello brand. So I got a couple of different, I got the premium baby lotion and the premium baby shampoo and wash. I really like the packaging of this. I think it's really cute. And I also wanted to try this Vivi and Bloom. So I got this, what is this? The two-in-one wash and shampoo cleansing gel, but it looks like this. Pretty self-explanatory, I feel like. All right, I also got some different pacifiers I was wanting to try out. I got this little set of Nano Baby Flexi pacifiers. Also got that MAM or MOM or however you pronounce it, brand, M-A-M. This is a little pack of three pacifiers. And I got these Dr. Brown's ones, these Happy Passies. Let's take these out so you can see. These ones aesthetically were so up my alley, I'm not gonna lie, kind of drew me to them because they have a black one, a kind of grayish, like a grayish color and a white pacifier. Also got, okay, these are hilarious. Let me show you. I got two different mustache pacifiers, which I thought were hilarious. This one is a classic little black mustache. Uh, this is giving me major Luigi vibes. And then the cowboy handlebar mustache, of course. The handlebar mustache is a must. I'm not gonna lie, I can't wait to see what the baby looks like with these on. Also, what did I get? Oh, I got this Frida baby. This is the pacifier with the, what do you call it? Accudose Passy. So it's a medicine dispenser and pacifier. So the baby can have the pacifier in their mouth and then you can use the syringe to give them their medicine for the pacifier. I thought that was a great idea. I mean, I don't, once again, I don't know anything about anything, but I thought it was a good idea and probably good to have in their little first aid kit. So I got this. I also got these. I'm so excited to try these. I've heard all about them. These little butt spatulas is what they are. So you take your little diaper rash cream and you spread it on their little butt. And then that way you don't have it all over your hands when you're trying to wrap up their diaper and their onesie back on or whatever, their sleeper back on, whatever it is. Um, and yeah, I love the whole idea. I don't know how practical they are, but once again, I wanted to give them a try and see what all the rage is about. Right next up, the baby gremlin got some really cute stuffed animals. These are so cute. First of all, he got his first ever plush Harry Potter. Look how cute. <laughs> also this little plush and super soft. This is so soft. Like I just want to sit here and squeeze it. Uh, but this super soft head wig. Also my aunt got me this whole Winnie the Pooh set. There's Winnie the Pooh and this is the cutest little Winnie the Pooh. So soft. Piglet. Uh, Tigger of course. And Eeyore, my personal favorite. I always loved Eeyore growing up. I cannot get over how soft these are. Does anyone else just melt when they see these cute little baby things? Like, I cannot get enough. Also, the baby got this little hedgehog soother. It's calming vibrations with 10 plus minutes of music. And I could press it, but I don't know if it'll stop. Uh, but it's this really soft, plushy hedgehog, which the whole idea of a stuffed hedgehog, he's so cute, the little smiley face. Ugh, I cannot get enough of these little, little plushy things. I also got this for the car seat or stroller to where the baby has something to look at. There's like a little mirror 
and then there's a snail. Next up, I got this portable bag. It's kind of like how I will describe it is like, because I've had dogs, it's kind of like the little mini poop bags that you carry with you <laughs> when you're walking your dog. So if they go to the bathroom, you can pick it up kind of thing. It's kind of like that concept, but for babies <laughs> is what I'm gonna put out there, I think. I don't know. Once again, I don't know anything about anything when it comes to babies, but in my mind, it's like that concept. So if you're somewhere where you don't have, like there's no trash can or whatnot, uh, you can put your baby's diaper in the little bag and then kind of tie it up so it doesn't stink. Uh, but then I also got a couple of refill bags. Oh, I also got some pacifier clip holders. Just a couple, a gray one and a beige one. Oh, I also got, this is so cute. I showed a clip of this on my baby shower vlog, uh, but this, cute silicone bib that says wickedly cute on it. It has a jack-o'-lantern and some candy corn. And this cute little pumpkin rattle that comes with it. I also got this, uh, this is the infrared no touch forehead thermometer. This is gonna come in handy once again for the first aid kit. I'm not gonna take off this sticker because it's ridiculous, but it's this modern looking thermometer. I also got this, this is interesting, but again, I really wanted to try it out and I hear really good things about it. This is the Frida Baby 3-in-1 Nose, Nail, and Ear Picker. <laughs> you can pick the boogers out of their nose, the earwax out of their ears, all the things, uh, or dirt under their nails. It's a whole picker. Also got this another spooky Halloween-y thing, these silicone teethers. Look at the jack-o'-lantern one, it's so cute. And then the other one looks like chocolate. Also got this guy, this cute little zebra teether. It's a teether in the shape of a zebra and this cute little mini head wig. Once again, so soft. Also got this sound machine. This is the Yoga Sleep Baby Hush sound machine. And let me tell you about the little portable sound machine. So back when we were Halloween decor hunting, I was at Target one day. I don't know if I mentioned it. I know I talked about it, but I don't know if it made the cut, but I had gone on a whole rant about it and I may have just cut it out because we would have been there for 300 hours. But I was in Target walking around looking for Halloween and I heard this amazing white noise. Like it just was so soothing. I was like, where is this coming from? And I was just, I was just immediately relaxed. I was like, I need one of these to put in my purse and walk around the different stores because it just is so soothing. And then I realized that there was someone in front of me with a stroller pushing their baby. And this was like kind of in or around or near their stroller or in her bag or I don't know where it was, but I could hear it and it was so soothing. And I was like, that is such a good idea. But I've also heard about bringing this to the hospital since there's a lot of noise in the hospital and a lot going on uh, to help you get some sleep in the hospital. So I think I'm gonna bring this with me. Multi-purpose, once again, peace. You know, I love it. I also got the Bordeaux Butt Paste Max Strength. Wanted to try a couple of different brands. So this is one of the ones I registered for. Uh, and then what else did I get? Oh, my stepmom got, this is the sweetest little, this came from Hallmark. It's baby's first hairbrush and comb. And this is so special. It's one of those fancy, you know, hairbrush and comb sets. These are beautiful. It's a really soft bristle brush and a cute little matching comb. I don't want to hurt your eyes, but uh, it's such a cute little special beautiful brush and comb set. Also got a pack of 10 burp cloths, just some white burp cloths. I know I'm gonna need these. These are definitely an essential, so I got these. All right, next I got this spooky blanket. How cute is this cat blanket? It's this black cat spooky blanket. My stepbrother got this for me and it's got all these little black cats all over it and it is so soft. You know, I'm going to be fighting means for this. Next up, I got a bunch of books and I'm going to go through these quickly just to kind of get through it because I know we've been here for 3,000 years, but I got this my first Winnie the Pooh book, Bigfoot Baby and Nessie baby and these are little lift the flap books my stepbrother got these for the baby so perfect this one I love you to the moon and back so cute and 365 bedtime stories and rhymes I'm gonna get so much use out of this I'm so excited about it also a classic the very hungry caterpillar and a love you till the cows come home I've never heard of this one, but it looks so cute, all the little cows. And Winnie the Pooh ABC, Mother Goose Treasury, a timeless collection of favorite nursery rhymes. This one's so cute too. Eight Little Planets, 
Uh, and my stepbrother, he just came through with all these amazing, dark, spooky books I'm so excited about. Luna Obscura, The Little Ghost Who Was a Quilt. <laughs> oh God, it gets me every time. Mr. Pumpkin's Tea Party, Werewolf, Werewolf. I feel like we need to do a whole spooky book reading or something. And the Cyclops Witch and the Heebie Jeebies. Whole spooky book set with all these different uh, Monster ABC, Goodnight Krampus. <sighs> Goodnight Krampus, I'm so excited. Get Dressed Sasquatch, Hush Now Banshee, and Don't Eat Me Chupacabra. These books are so perfect for the spooky nursery. I cannot wait to put together this whole spooky little library. I'm so excited. Okay, I also got some wipes and some diapers, just different types of diapers. I got some Huggies, I got some Hello Bellows. I don't know if you're interested in even seeing. They're pretty self-explanatory wipes and diapers. I got various sizes, various brands. I'm interested, once again, it's kind of like the bottles and the pacifiers where I wanted to try different brands to see what works for us. But I wanted to move on to the clothes because I'm so excited about, you know how I get with baby clothes. They're just so cute and little and I just get, ugh, I get all mushy about it. Before we do that though, I wanted to show you this blanket that my friend Haley, if you watched the baby shower vlog, you met her. She crocheted this blanket for the baby gremlin and this is so soft it's so beautiful i love anything handmade and from the heart so baby's aunt Haley made this crocheted blanket it's so cute so very slytherin so oh i guess this isn't all baby clothes this is all the stuff that needs to be washed so there's a couple things i'll show you and i also got this blanket this constellation blanket which is really pretty has moons and stars constellations all the things and then i also got these burp burps bees burps bees burp claws hello comes in the cutest little patterns so there's a moon pattern a kind of grayish grayy kind of color blue and gray stripes a blue one and this white one with all these little blue stars all over it. So cute. And I also got these matching hooded towels. These Burt's Bees hooded towels in the moon print and the star print. And it has little bees in there too. So cute. And I'm not scared of bees, everybody. Just wasps. So I'm okay with this whole situation. <laughs> and then I also got this nursing poncho. Really cute. Black and white. You know I had to get the black and white stripes, everybody. Could not resist. Um, but it's just a black and white stripe. Pretty self-explanatory nursing poncho. And then, are we, oh wait, no, we have one more towel thing. This cute hooded shark towel, everybody. This is one of those things that just makes my soul turn to complete mush. Okay, I think we're moving on to clothes and there's something else that's sprinkled in there. We'll just talk about it when we get there, but I wanted to move on to clothes because I'm so excited to show you these pieces. So my stepmom packaged up a gift and it said from mom and dad, like from my mom and dad. But I guess my stepmom found a bunch of clothes that were mine and also my brothers growing up. First up, this Casey Royals jacket from the 80s. My brother and I wore this and on the back it says Royals on it. I cannot wait for the full circle moment when my dad takes the little baby gremlin to his first Royals game because he used to take my brother and I, hold on my throat. I'm like losing my voice. I've been talking for so long. <laughs> I guess there was way more here than I thought. And so anyways, I got this cute little Royals jacket. This is so special. And also my little bomber jacket you guys my brother and I if I have the picture I'll show it here my brother and I had matching bomber jackets these are actual uh, it says top pilot is the brand I don't even know this is clearly from the 80s and it's a whole little top gun inspired bomber jacket my brother and I were obsessed with top gun when we were little kids also look at this suit jacket this was my brother's this little suit jacket it's got a whole dracula vibe i don't even know what he wore this for i think maybe it was one of my aunt's weddings or something like that i love anything that's nostalgic so those were so so special i'm excited to see those i was not expecting that so anyways moving on we have more clothes to get through i'm going to try to go through these quickly first of all we have this newborn sleeper set so there's a gray and white striped one a cloud one this one's so cute and then this cute little dark gray one with little plus signs all over it. This is from the brand Cloud Island. So from Target, which I've heard these ones are good. They're really soft. 
Also, God, this is so cute. This Hannah Anderson, that's the brand, um, makes these really, really soft, high quality sleeper onesie things. My mom's friend got this Harry Potter sleeper with the cutest pattern and then also this one with the little whales all over it so cute all right next up is this really soft thermal i love all the thermal stuff really soft thermal little jumpsuit thing this is zero to three months really really soft and this little pack of three onesies has little elephants on one of them a cute little white onesie and this bluish grayish this cute little print all over it also got oh my gosh this was so cute this just about killed me this, these little sweatpants okay first of all look how tiny these are and this rolling stones sweatshirt it's like a whole little set that goes together what size is this it is tiny newborn i'm thinking it was so tiny look at these little pants all right next up this striped little koala sleeper and this set here, this onesie set, says wildly in love with Dada. Green and white striped onesie and another little elephant patterned onesie. I wish I had another word for cute, but I don't right now. That's all that's coming out. It's just, uh, my, like I said, my soul is leaving my body because these things are so cute. This little tank top, little romper with, it's a little checkered romper with a little whale. <laughs> Oh God. Also, this Winnie the Pooh set comes with the little onesie. These little pants, the pants just get me every time. They're just so small. The matching little Winnie the Pooh hat and bib. All little Winnie the Pooh. Hopefully I'm not going too fast. So you saw the Rolling Stones set, but I also got a Guns N' Roses version. This Guns N' Roses sweatshirt and the little joggers that go with it. This size is six to nine months. So we have some options, everybody. And we got this little tank top. This is a pack of one, two, three, four, five. There's a crab one, a little palm tree, little tank top onesie, more little crabs everywhere, a little checkered situation, and just eight, no, this one has a whole little tropical situation on the front. This little striped sleeper with a little dog and then the little dog slippers or footies at the bottom. And my grandma got the baby these little blue boots. Look at these. These are so cute. Also more of this thermal feel. I love, once again, this thermal feel. There's a white hat and a blue hat with little bear ears. Look at this little sleeper with all the little safari animals on it. Oh my gosh, so cute. And then this one here, this romper, so short sleeves and shorts for summer, perfect. And then this one, oh my gosh, this is an Old Navy one, you know. I love a good Old Navy little sleeper. This one has little acorns all over it with little faces on all the little acorns oh and this one I thought was so cute too caterpillar onesie it is so cute with all these little green caterpillars all over it oh. dinosaur sleeper also this cute little tie-dye or acid wash or I don't know what to call this but I love this whole look what else did we get oh I think my mom got me this this really soft baby blue blanket it is so freaking soft. If Neen's even sensed that this existed, she would be all over it. It is that soft because she knows she has to have the softest blankets ever. So we gotta keep Neen's. She has a whole bunch of blankets. So she's got a share. Also got some more socks, these Cat and Jack socks. I love the Cat and Jack brand, by the way. And more cute onesies. These have little, there's a camo one and dinosaurs. And what's on this side? Uh, more dinosaurs and is that it and oh my gosh my mom got me these as well these are so cute these little faux chucks basically these little glittery black high tops I am so excited he's gonna be the coolest little baby oh also to match these dinosaur onesies I uh, got some dinosaur hats, camo one, there's a little dino one, and then this gray one, but it has little dino spikes on the back of the hat. Another blanket, this one has little sheep all over it. Once again, super soft. Also, my mom got me a bunch of these essentials, which are much needed, uh, just little pairs of pants. So I have a couple of different gray pairs and some little shorts. Look at these shorts. <laughs> 
so little and had a little drawstring. Like, I can't believe he's gonna be this tiny. What size is this? Three months, so cute. And then some onesies, some just basic gray and white onesies that I'm gonna need, um, that I'm sure I'll get a lot of use out of. So just these classic little onesies and just various sizes. Last but not least, there were a couple of things that were too big to bring in here and show you. So I'll show you pictures or visuals of what I got or something so you can at least see what it is. Um, I got the car seat. It's the the one that kind of grows into toddlerhood and all that kind of stuff and their kid seat. Uh, I got the Evenflow Revolve, which is the one that rotates. I think somebody actually mentioned it in one of my vlogs. They were like, oh my gosh, you gotta get the rotating seat. It's so much easier to get your kid in and out of the seat. Um, I also got the stroller, y'all. I was so excited about the stroller. My dad and my stepmom, they got me the stroller I was really wanting, which is the Juvie Cool. That's the one I ended up registering for. So I got the Juvie Cool, I put it together. That will be in a whole separate vlog if it's not out already also got a pack and play which we're going to keep down on the main level that's going to be where we change the baby and the baby will nap during the day and that kind of stuff and it's the one that has the detachable little bassinet thing um anyways i think that's it i say that's it <laughs> it was a lot of stuff i just feel so lucky to have the support in the village that i do it, it honestly gets me a little emotional to even talk about it or think about it just because I feel like it it is a full circle moment. A lot of my family and family friends and everyone, we've been through life together. And so to have, you know, to bring new life into the mix is just exciting and so good to see everybody and talk to everyone and you could just feel the love in the room. All that's left to do is get ready for this baby and get things washed up and organized and cleaned and everything and just really dive into nesting and I'm so excited about it. Um, anyways, I just was so excited to show you what I got for my shower, just all the cute little baby things, but also if you're having a shower of your own coming up or your friend or family member or whatever, if you see any of these items on the registry and you're curious about what they looked like or what you know all the different things um then i don't know maybe in some way this video was helpful but if not if you just were here to see all the cute little baby things then i was excited to show you that too so yeah anyways that is it for this video i hope you enjoyed it if you did you can give it a thumbs up say hey ghoul hey down in the comments because you know i love talking to you and yeah anything else you want to talk about in the comments anyways thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys next time